In this video, I'm going to show you how to use math functions and worksheet functions in VBA. So let's go over to the VBA window. I'm just going to use the immediate window for now. There are several things you can do with math. So let me do this question mark math dot, and you can see you can use the absolute value and cosines and logs and random numbers, rounding, sines, tangents, squares, all sorts of stuff. Um, you can play around with this. I'm just going to show you the rand function. It comes in handy. If I do math.rand, hit enter, I get some random number. Let me do that times 100 and times 100. And I get a whole random number here. Let me do this. Let me round that random, round that random number to two decimals. Not 21 decimals, two decimals. And I get that. I suppose I could do 21. Let me try that. It won't go to 21. Oh well. I can do it to 2. I can do it to 0, which comes in handy. So I should get whole numbers. Yeah. Pretty cool. And that's the math dot whatever. That's math dot rand. You can play around with the others. Well, let's do this. This one comes in mega handy. Worksheet function. All one word. Dot. And you can do it any worksheet function you want. For example, I can do the average of, let's say, um, my active cell dot current rain, or current region. Let me find out what my active cell is here. It's over here, okay? So it's gonna grab everything in this whole region and give me the average of it. It is 4.9333. That's big, let me round that out. Round all of that. Two, two decimals, 4.93, there we go. I could also do this, instead of average, do the sum, enter, and it's 148. I could do, you know, whatever. Uh, I could do um, count if, and in this region, count if there are twos. How many are there? Argument not optional. Oh, oh I'm rounding it. Get rid of that. Okay, count if, and in that region, if there are twos. And it says there are three twos over there. How many fives are there? That many. Heck, I could do a VLOOKUP, VLOOKUP of something. Um, you could do anything you want that is an Excel function. Do you see the power of this? It is amazing. Also, what is fantastic about worksheet functions is they're exceptionally efficient. They don't take up a lot of processing resources. So if you can use these properly, they're actually pretty good. I hope that helps.